Hey everybody, Daniel Fusco here and welcome to today's two minute message. So I wanna share with you something that I am super excited about. You ready? I got a brand new book coming out. It's so true and I'm super excited about it. This fall I have a new book coming out called Crazy Happy, Nine Surprising Ways to Live the Truly Beautiful Life. Now listen, I know some of you are like, oh man, why is he talking about a book? Because listen, kind of like writing a book is kind of like having a baby. Although you don't need to send them to college. You don't need to feed them every day, but it's a labor of love. And, and, and I wouldn't have written it if I wasn't super excited about it. And as I've been thinking more and more about it, knowing that this book is coming out, I, I, I love the fact, and I shouldn't be surprised by this, but I kind of am, that Jesus, who I believe in, knew that this book was going to be coming out in a time when so many people are struggling to be happy. Because listen, you guys all know what's going on. We're, we're in the midst of a long-term a global public health crisis still going on. It's a very contentious election year going on. Uh, the economy is kind of uh, kind of confusing right now. Many people have lost their jobs and people have been stuck home with their families. And listen, I wrote this book because God wants everyone to be happy. But the problem is, is when I say that, all of us think, oh, this is how I, I want to be happy. I want this, this, and this. And our plans for happiness is totally different for God's plan. That's why I call it crazy happy. It's not that we're going to be like happy, happy, joy, joy, smiling from the face out. But God's plan for happiness is found in unique places, surprising places. I have to call it crazy places. So listen, you can pick up this book, pre-order the book, wherever you like to buy your books. Uh, all the stores are going to have it. And even if you go, you know, you go to your, your local, you know, indie bookstore, don't forget those folks, man. Like, and just say, hey, listen, can you get this book? They'll be able to get it for you. Because God wants to cultivate a unique happiness in each one of our lives. That's what I do. I want you to share this message. And in the comment section, what do you believe to be God's plan for happiness, because the Bible speaks about it in lots and lots of places, and I unpack it in the book, but just to kind of get a sense for how we see happiness as a community, put that in the comment section. We're going to learn together, and God bless you today.